Eve Jahan Cooper, known mononymously as Eve, is an American rapper, singer, songwriter, and actress. In 1999, she released her debut album, Let There Be Eve, Rough Rider's First Lady, which reached number one on the Billboard 200, making her the third female rapper to accomplish this feat and was certified double platinum by the Recording Industry Association of America. The album produced the hit singles What You Want, Love Is Blind, and Got A Man. That same year, she was featured on the Roots single You Got Me, as well as Missy Elliott's Hot Boys, the latter of which peaked within the top 10 of the Billboard Hot 100. Eve has an estimated net worth of 12 million U.S. dollars. About Eve's Early Life Eve Jahan Cooper Jeffers was born on November 10, 1978, in Philadelphia. She's the daughter of Julie Wilcher, a publishing company supervisor, and Jerry Jeffers, a chemical plant supervisor. She lived in West Philadelphia until age 13 when her family moved to the neighborhood of Germantown. She graduated from Martin Luther King High School in Philadelphia. At the age of 18, she worked as a stripper until rapper Mays convinced her to stop stripping. In 1999, Eve discussed stripping in an interview with Rolling Stone, saying that it was a hustle too. There's a song about it on my album, Heaven Only Knows. But I don't regret it. I was 18 and confused going through personal problems. I did it for about a month, and I was glad I did it. It helped me find Eve. Helped me get serious. It was depressing. A lot of those girls have three or four kids. I'd sit there and be like, Eve, you don't belong here. This is not your world. Her first musical interest was singing. She sang in many choirs and even formed an all-female singing group, Dope Girls Posse, or EDGP, with a manager. This group covered songs from En Vogue and Color Me Bad. This group's manager suggested that they should start rapping, and Eve stuck with it. After the group split up, she began working on a solo career under the name Eve of Destruction. She's 5 feet 6 inches tall or 1.7 meters tall. About Eve's personal life In 2010, Eve began dating Maximilian Cooper. The couple became engaged on December 25, 2013 and married on June 14, 2014 in Ibiza, Spain. She has four stepchildren, all from Cooper's previous marriage to business person Julie Brangstrup. In October 2021, Eve announced she was expecting her first child with Cooper due in February. They welcomed their first child, a son, Wild Wolf, on February 1, 2022. Eve divides her time between London, Los Angeles, and New York. About Eve's career In 1998, Eve appeared on the Bullworth soundtrack as Eve of Destruction while signed to Dr. Dre's record label, Aftermath Entertainment. She appeared on DMX's song, Rough Rider's Anthem, Remix, from his album, It's Dark and Hell is Hot, and the root single, You Got Me, from the band's fourth album, Things Fall Apart. She also provided background vocals on the root song, Ain't Saying Nothing New, from Things Fall Apart, and is credited as Eve of Destruction. In June 1999, Eve's first single, What Y'all Want, featuring Nokia, the entity of Drew Hill, was released. The song peaked at number 29 on the U.S. Billboard Hot 100 chart and at number 1 on the Hot Rap Songs chart. In 1999, What Y'all Want was included on the compilation album Ride or Die Volume 1, and that same year, Eve released her debut album Let There Be Eve, Rough Rider's First Lady which reached number one on the Billboard 200, making her the third female rapper to accomplish this feat and was certified double platinum by the Recording Industry Association of America. The album produced the hit singles What You Want, Love Is Blind, and Got A Man. That same year, she was featured on the Roots single You Got Me, as well as Missy Elliott's Hot Boys, the latter of which peaked within the top 10 of the Billboard Hot 100. Her second studio album, Scorpion, in 2001, peaked in the top 10 of the Billboard 200 and was certified platinum by the RIAA. Its single, Let Me Blow Your Mind, won her the inaugural Grammy Award for Best Rap Collaboration and an MTV Video Music Award and peaked at number 2 on the Billboard Hot 100. Her follow-up album, Evolution, in 2002, also peaked in the top 10 of the Billboard 200 and yielded the single Gangsta Lovin', which reached number 2 on the Hot 100. Her other singles from these albums, Satisfaction and Love is Blind, as well as her 2000 standalone single, Tambourine, all reached the top 40 of the Hot 100. She was also featured on Gwen Stefani's song, Rich Girl, in 2005, which was certified double platinum by the RIAA and nominated for a Grammy Award. 
After parting ways with Interscope Records, Eve released Lip Lock in 2013. This was her first independent studio album. As an actress, she starred as Terry Jones in the comedy drama films Barbershop, Barbershop 2 Back in Business, and Barbershop The Next Cut, and played the lead role of Shelley Williams on the UPN television sitcom Eve. She also had supporting roles in the drama film The Woodsman in 2004, the comedy film The Cookout in 2004, and the horror film Animal in 2014. From 2017 to 2020, she was one of the co-hosts of the CBS daytime talk show The Talk, for which she earned two Daytime Emmy Award nominations. Eve has also graced the covers of numerous magazines, including Essence, Teen People, Allure, Rolling Stone, Paper, Philadelphia Style, Giant, Blaze, Vibe, Inked, XXL, and Ebony. She's also appeared in television commercials for Clarica, Pepsi, and Sprite. Her print ads include Tommy Hilfiger and MAC Cosmetics' Viva Glam campaign. In 2003, she launched a clothing line titled Fetish, which was targeted towards black women. Fetish was discontinued in September 2009. About Eve's real estate. In 2005, Eve paid $1.8 million for a 4,297-square-foot home in the Hollywood Hills. She sold this home in 2011 for $1.3 million. Eve and husband Maximilian Cooper own a home in Los Angeles where they live with their son. About Eve's car collection. Eve owns or has owned a Bentley Flying Spur, a Mercedes CL Class, a Rolls-Royce Dawn, a Mercedes-Benz G-Wagon, and a Ferrari California. Thanks so much for watching today. Give us a like and share us with your friends. Don't forget to subscribe.